Hey Vibes fam, welcome back to my channel where good food and good vibes is a must. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be making some blended seasoning and here are my ingredients that I will be using and here I chop them up. So now I'm going to be adding them to my chopper. Here I'm adding some onions, you know you have to put that in there some scallion or green onions get that all up in there and of course some sweet peppers all the colors of the rainbow my favorite we can't leave these out and now we're going in with some garlic and for my garlic lovers you know you can go in and some thyme what's the thyme the thyme is to add some thyme the smell of the time is mm, everything so yes add some time and then now i'm going in with some pepper and these they are so hot trust me this ended up having such a kick and of course some t pimento i was gonna say tomato ginger i'm not adding too much ginger right because it's not every recipe that you want to put ginger in so it's just a little bit and I'm going back in with some more sweet peppers because I have more space, right? And um, what else am I going to dash in there? Of course, I'm going to be using a bit of olive oil. You don't have to put it in there, but I like to put it in there. And now let's cover and we're going to blend. <sighs> And now that we have chopped it all up, here I was, it's looking that pepper right there got away because it was stuck in the top. So I'm just gonna, now that we have more space and everything has small up itself, like in a little mini bus, I'm adding the rest of the ingredients and then we're gonna go in for another chop. It's not a blend, it's a chop. Well, yeah, it's blending, getting everything together, blend, chop, everything. Go ahead. And vibes fam this is smelling so delightfully delicious already so now i am all done and look at it look at all this deliciousness can you tell already that when you add this to your pot when you add this to anything that you're seasoning up i'm telling you vibes fam all the goodness if you don't normally do this do it so here i'm showing you how i normally store it always in a glass jar and what i'm doing i'm pressing it down so that to get rid of the air bubbles as well as to make more space so that's one jar and now i'm doing another one and i always make like good amount and i just put it in the fridge right always store it in the fridge J glass jars way better so i got three jars of this deliciousness and vibes fam here we have it here we have my delicious nice luxuriously smoothly <laughs> blended seasoning so of course for most things that i cook you guys always see me added it so this is what it is right and guess what you don't have to put the pep the hot pepper in there right but i like to add a little bit so that when i'm cooking i don't really have to put any pepper in there because i have my little babies eating the food too but um yeah and also make sure when you're taking this out to season your meat always use a clean spoon don't use a spoon that you're dipping other seasoning or anything else it helps to preserve it and to keep it nice and long lasting <laughs> so yeah vibes so i'm go ahead and try this recipe and thank you so much for watching this is the behind the scenes of the photo shoot and for hanging out with me don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and please go and follow me on instagram and on facebook god bless you thank you